This is 13-year-old Ali Hashim. One year ago tonight, Ali was hit and killed while riding his bike. Here's video from that intersection last year. There's no sidewalks or crosswalks in that area. Police believe that's why Ali was riding his bike out in the street. Local 5's Bryn Carmen is live at that intersection right now. And Bryn, even one year later, there's still a memorial there for Ali. Jack, Stephanie, one year later, as you can see, this memorial still stands. There's still a lot of Ali's favorite things. Earlier today, several kids in the community came here to pay their respects. As you can see, he really loved the color blue. Police even have a lane of Merle Hay still blocked off to make sure everyone stayed safe today. One year later, Ali's family says it's not any easier than the day it happened. Today is, is a very hard day. It's been one year since 13-year-old Ali Hashim died. He was hit by a truck while riding on his bicycle near the intersection of Northwest 66th Avenue and Merle Hay Road. The chilling details of that night still haunt his dad, Karim. I not feel really like what I see when I run. This is my son. Karim was out and about that night and actually drove up on the scene of the crash before realizing it was his boy. I to, to hug my son, the police catch me, they not want to let me, like, touch him. After the accident that claimed his son's life, Karim begged the city to improve sidewalks. Johnston promised changes, and a year later, city administrator Jim Sanders says progress has been made. And the idea would be we'd go out and inspect sidewalks probably beginning this fall and, and order the repair or, or placement or construction of sidewalks in areas where we don't currently have sidewalks. As you can see from the area where the crash happened, there are no sidewalks. And because it's the one-year anniversary of Ali's passing, several members of the community came to pay their respects. Police decided to block off one lane of traffic to ensure safety. And knowing that headway is being made for more sidewalks means so much for this grieving father. We not want this accident happen to any from a child. The last 12 months, Karim has tried to move forward. In November, he opened this Middle Eastern grocery store in Windsor Heights, a dream Ali was part of. He had with me, he bent with me, he cleaned with me. After Ali passed away, Karim found a very fitting way to remember and honor his son. He named his store after him. He told me I would be famous, but he coming famous, but after he passed away. And that was Bryn Carmen reporting. Karim has been working with the city and police department uh, since Ali passed away about putting up a permanent memorial there. They designed a beautiful sculpture that features a picture of Ali. It should be installed in the next few weeks. The city of Johnston says sidewalk repairs or additions could be done as early as spring, weather permitting.